advice for dog enthusiasts. Tall, elegant ones. Short, scruffy ones. The Stacey Solomon look. Is she beautiful? Uh, uh, yeah, I'm sure it's very fashionable. Anyway, for Battersea, today belongs to Staffies, and they're setting out to prove that rescue dogs can be winners too. We're gonna win, we're gonna win, we're gonna win. I've just gotta make sure Frank's gonna listen to me. Frank, we're gonna win, aren't we? Who tells me? Never mind getting round me, Frank. This is just no good. This is the agility course. It's four times the size of the one at Battersea. You're gonna spot up here, over the jump. Yeah. The Do I have to jump over it as well? No! <laughs> this is, I can just, I can't believe this. I think Ali's title hopes are fading, but I've got a secret weapon. Okay, you like to take treats in your hands? No. <laughs> Look, desperate times call for desperate measures. Look what I've got. Wait, let's show you my secret weapon. No, don't take it out. He's eating it, then he's dragged it out, eating it. It's the moment of truth. I'm nervous. The staffies are up. Don't panic too much, ladies. They're very tough and sturdy breeders. Because I'm all well doing it beautifully. It's Percival privilege. Or should I say, Sir Percival privilege. <laughs> well, there's one there who's not doing it properly. Little further, just touch the white bit. Go on. Saying that old Frank might come up drugs. I think Frank's alright, it's just, it's usually about a handler. <laughs> you listen to me, you're going in that ring to pop, but you're coming out to star. Yeah? Now let's go out and win, Frank. We're going to win, okay? Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, Frank and Battersea Rescue with the fabulous Mr. Paul Brady. That's it, Frank. Come on, good boy. Frank, no, Frank, Frank, come here. Wait, 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 wait. This isn't going to plan. I'm going to have to take a shortcut. This way. Frank, this way, Frank. Come on, wait. Come on. Come on, Frank. Go, boy. Frank, come on, come on, come on. Hey! Well done. Good work, Frankie. I just hope no one noticed we missed out half the course. In the fastest time, 22 seconds. It's Frank with Mr. Paul O'Grady. Well, what do you know, eh? We got away with this. That's lovely. Thank you very much. Thank you, Frank. Look what we've won. Aye, Frankie boy. Look what we've won. Give us a kiss. Yeah, give us a kiss. Ladies and gentlemen, please, a big round of applause for Paul O'Grady. We've done it for Battersea Dogs, though. Yay! And I'd just like to add, that rescue dogs can do it just as well as your posh dogs. So we're going home now to celebrate. Cheers. It's nearly 2 a.m. and there's an emergency at Battersea. Head vet Sean and four nurses have hurried into the clinic. Little Bourbon's gone into labour. She's not very restless, uh, some mess making, so we definitely know it's the right time. It's not safe for such a tiny dog to deliver four puppies, so Sean's got to do a C-section. You won't know if the dog's alive until we get in there, so it's fingers crossed. Okay, folks, if you're squeamish, look away now. But it'd be a shame, because it's a rare thing you're about to see. Sean does once as early in a year, if that. It might look like something as of alien, that there is Bourbon's uterus. The first pops out in its own individual sack with the afterbirth attached. But it's not breathing yet. And now it's a race against time. The nurses have to...